All right, people, what's up, everyone? And welcome to another release day unboxing with your big boy, Buddy Gore. And uh, the backlog is already looking kind of scary this year. Why is there so many games coming out so early in the year? I mean, it happens every year, so I don't know why I've asked that question. But still, why? So many games. I mean, it took until close to the end of January until things started coming out. I mean, I know One Piece came out last week, but that, that wasn't particularly for me. I, I never really watched One Piece. Well, I watched the four kids, though. Um, but that's like, what, 40 episodes or something like that? Um, and that's like maybe, what was that, like 0.0001% of that anime? Um, but uh yeah like next week is um dead space and forespoken then week after that or like week and a half after that is a hogwarts legacy and then after that is atomic heart and then it just keeps it keeps going there's too many games already anyway so this is one of those this is fire emblem engaged this is the divine edition of course uh which i'm gonna hope that this is a well it ain't gonna be short, but like a shorter game than Three Houses was at least, because Three Houses took well like a hundred hours to finish one route, and then you have to go back. Well, you don't have to, but I keep hearing you should go back and do other routes and stuff. I'm like, I got like five hours in. What the fuck? <laughs> so here's the Divine Edition. I had to get this. I really like these. Uh, took a little, took a little damage there. Was that? I hope that was already like that, and just do that. Anyway, whatever casualties of war but um yeah so i i'm really really liking these boxes that nintendo does these special edition boxes xenoblade uh i want to say the last three xenoblade games had boxes like this what else had this like metroid dread kind of yeah i guess it was kind of it was pretty much the same it wasn't as thick i don't think but it was like very similar what else had this um there was a few other games i'm sure but uh, anyway i like these boxes especially when it comes to the artwork look at that artwork look how good that looked just like really appreciate it i had to record this in 4k i don't know when the freaking 4k will process so but look at that box art that that that's good box art baby anyway here's the side i've been showing it because this is what's gonna you're, you're gonna see this most of the time in a in your collection uh, unless you like to present it i mean i buy a lot of shit so i can't have every box presented on my bookcase but uh you know like that so that's not a bad, nice little gradient there hey eh? uh here's the back I like that they keep the backs uh, pretty simple. I, I want to say most of them have been very simple. Uh, Fire Emblem Engage, a nice little texture background kind of thing going on, and then just the symbol, and then what it comes with. Uh, the top, of course, just says Nintendo, and then that stuff, and then there you go. So there you go. That is that. Uh, goodbye. No, I'm just <laughs> I'm not done even unboxing yet. Where's my... Oh, by the way, I, I picked up a Sephiroth Amiibo. I was going to get the um, Casio one, but I didn't. So I'm not trying to collect every uh, Amiibo. So I just got that because I also had the cloud ones. So and also it's Sephiroth. Big boy Sephiroth. They actually did a pretty good job on the sword just from what I see there. I was actually worried when I heard about um, uh, the Amiibo coming uh, that the sword would look kind of stubby, but it actually looks pretty good. Um, is it the Masamune? Is that the Masamune? Yeah, it is, I think. All right, so let's open this bad boy, baby. Let's go. Sorry, I'm getting like a bunch of notifications on my phone right now. Yo, Wario 64, slow down. I get it. There's deals. Okay? Can you stop, please? I'm using my phone, by the way, if you're confused why. I said that. So, all right, here we go. Opening it up. Oh, oh, that's good. Hold on. Look at this. You got to see this. Look at that. Look at that presentation. You open it up. Me, you got little sprites of your main characters right there. You got, I forgot their names, actually. But there's the male and female one, I assume so. I, I, I'm not 100% sure. It looks like that's the case. Not 100% sure, but no, that's definitely the male one. I guess that's the female one. I don't know. Anywho, maybe it's not. Maybe it's another character. But uh, damn, what the fuck? I, I was just looking at the art again. The art's so good. Yo, shout out. Whoever did this art. What is this? Is this Drew, Drew Struzan? You do this? <laughs> He's doing anime now? Um, all right. Uh, so let's take out. This is probably the game. Oh, okay. We have to take the whole thing out. Oh, that's so good. All right. Here. Let me just show you real quick. Look at this. Sprites for everybody. I was going to do the Oprah, you get a Sprite, you get a Sprite, but I'm not going to do it, even though I technically just did it. Um, And then you have, what is this? You have the poster. Oh, that's nice. Nice little poster. And then here's the art book, which it's a sideways art book, which I fucking hate. So... Is it? Yeah, it is. Uh, so, 
that's everything in the box by the way nothing else in the box so sideways art book it's like this you know i guess i mean i guess i guess it's okay i'm gonna put it right back in there but i, I don't like it's really hard to present these on a bookshelf especially when you have, don't have like the deepest um i guess I, when it comes to depth like my bookcase isn't the biggest so it's gonna be sticking out a little bit so i don't know it's just it's i don't like these type i, I i'm sure inside this inside is gonna be so good with the art so so good but uh yeah anyway here's the poster again we're gonna we're gonna look into those later uh by the way i i forgot to mention this but uh if you pre-order at gamestop you get a tarot card pack which uh i'll open at the end because why not uh, here's the steel book, which uh, I know that pisses some people off because I know a lot of people that are big steel book collectors, but they are not collector edition collectors. So if you want this, you gotta get the collector's edition, baby. So you got look at that artwork. That looks so good too. Uh, wish my lighting was a little bit better. I apologize. Here, you go. let's crank it up a little bit. Actually. There you go. There you go. Is that better? Yeah, a little bit. There you go. Oh shit, Sonic the Hedgehog two inch figure is only five bucks on Amazon? Wow, thank you. <laughs> thank you, Warriors. Actually, it's Cheap Ass Gamer that said that one. Shout out to Cheap Ass Gamer. Anyway, there you go. There you go. And then, look at that. Look at that. You got the, you got the map. You got the map. There you go. Of the world, I guess. Try not to get that reflection. And you can see it. Oh, here's the spine. I wish all spines looked like that. Not like, here, let me just show you the actual game. Wait, this is the deluxe edition. Maybe the spines will be better. Let's see. Generic ass spine. There you go. That looks really nice. That box art too. I mean, it's the same as this, except it just says, it just says Fire Emblem instead. So it's the same same art. I almost wish the Steelbook art was a little bit different, but w without the, the logo there, and also maybe a little bit more emphasis on the clouds and stuff, it does look really nice. There's Marf. Hey guys, remember me from all the, all the other games of Marf. There you go. Um, we'll open that later. I just want to show everything first and then we'll get to it. And then this is the art cards, I would assume. So we'll open that too. I'm just gonna open everything, I don't give a shit. These, these ones don't normally, uh, oh, and oh, this is nice too. Dude, they put a lot of work into, here's the map, I assume, or the world. Uh, but like, look at all those characters. I don't know these characters yet. Some of them are probably based on older Fire Emblem characters. Like, um, is this a, let me look at her. I played the original two Fire Emblem games on GBA. And when I say the original two, obviously that's like not the, the original two for us, for us dirty Americans. But um, I don't remember all the characters names. It's been a very long time. Oh, here, that's the female character, right? So who the hell is this? Who that? I've been trying not to watch too many videos about uh, Fire Emblem Fates. Um, I was actually getting a little worried about it because, I, I don't know, I feel like there was a lot of hype for Three Houses, but there wasn't a lot of hype for this one. I think it's because of the whole, like, oh, we, uh, oh, like, look, it's the past stuff again, which I think some people are getting a little sick of, um, at least from all the reactions I watched. It seems like they were getting sick of it. Um like, all right, yeah, we get it. We get it. Like, I think, uh, what was that? The iPhone game is all about that, where it's like, oh, remember remember Tiki or whatever her name is? Or whatever her name is? Remember? Remember her? You know, she's back. It's like, all right, cool. Uh, and also, I think a lot of people compared it a little bit to, um, what was the Fire Emblem? Uh, Tokyo Mirage Sessions. There you go. Anyway, this is the poster. There you go. Oh, this, this is a big boy. I was actually expecting it to be a lot smaller. I'm sure it says the dimensions on the fucking back, but I, I didn't read it. Um, I just saw it's included poster. Not a double-sided poster. Oh, that's nice, actually. Ooh, I might have to go back a little bit. Make sure I'm not rolling anything over. Ooh, 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 that's just the, that's the, that's the box art. The actual box art for the collector's edition. Look at that. That's really nice. Look how nice that is. Look how land that, that shit is. Man, that's good art. Damn, bro. Drew Struzan, you nailed it. That like, look like anime. How you do it? Yeah, you used to make uh, people look realistic in your paintings for like the Star Wars and shit. For people that don't know who Drew Struzan is. 
he did the posters for like Indiana Jones, original Star Wars movies, you know, the good ones. Um, I think he did the prequels too, didn't he? Um, gonna bring them back, Disney? Huh? Drew, Drew, Drew Struzan? He might be retired at this point. I, I don't know, actually. <clears throat> I'm acting like I'm with the authority. I don't know. <laughs> Shit. Uh, anyway, that was a nice poster. Uh, art book. Uh, yeah, well, but I don't give a fuck. <laughs> I don't care. Again, this is not getting sold. I don't give a shit. Also, it becomes like a worth a million dollars. Like, oh shit. Even now, I'd be like, well, yeah, but I, I have it. So, a million dollars is cool, but it's not Fire Emblem Engage Divine Edition cool. Honestly, even Trump doesn't have this. So that means I'm better. Anyway, there you go. It's always got like a little indention, indentation intention yeah um there you go that's okay uh, hey, again awesome artwork very different though you have all the characters in the middle too in the circle going around look at that that's really nice here's the back look at that look at that you got the dragons fire emblem dragons yo why don't we gonna get a new breath of fire game so we get fucking dragons i mean this is not that's capcom this is not capcom obviously but i'm just saying you know Ooh, oh here I'll show a little bit. You're only gonna get a little bit. Ooh, what's what's this? Hopefully there's no spoilers in here. Ooh, oh what's that? This paper is weird. Feels like feels like paper. No. It feels a little lighter. No, it, it, I don't know. Whatever. No one cares. Maybe it's because the book is sideways like this. It just feels odd. Uh anyway, here's another character. I don't know. Oh, that's uh, Foghorn Leghorn. What the fuck is the name? Fogato? Okay. I'm, I'm trying to read it upside down. So, uh, Oh, here's another character. Ooh, who's that? Oh, I'm trying not to look. Ooh, wow. Uh, I'm not going to show too much more. Here, I'll show. Uh, ooh, what's this? Oh, wow. Whoa, look at that. That's nice. Oh, what's this? Whoa, what? Wow. What? 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 That's crazy. Anyway, there you go. Nice little art book again don't like sideways ones but that's just a personal preference and anyway, let's show this again with the better lighting here you go or actually did i already show this with the better lighting? i'm not 100 sure yeah i did now let's unbox oh no we gotta do the art cards shit shit sorry i know this is a long ass unboxing but you know that's that's what you get that's what you get all right i'm trying to open this it's not working out. All right. Yeah, man. I wish some of these had like more. Like I like the seal, um, the plastic seal, but I wish it had more. Like I kind of like what the poster was in, so I could put it back in. You know what I mean? Uh, I guess I could could have cut that a little bit better, but it was kind of like the cheap plastic where like it just kind of like. I don't know. Anyway, oh, this is what it looks like without the plastic. So there's no. Reflect. I mean, it's already reflecty, but no extra reflecty. Oh, okay. You could just open it like this. Ooh, I do like art cards. I wish there was a better way of presenting them. Look at these. I have a feeling this is exactly what the um, tarot cards are gonna look like. Uh, anyway, there's Marf. Here, I'm just. I'm gonna. I'm gonna flip through them. Oh, uh, she's from. Uh, it was in 3ds. It was a remake. It was Gaiden, right? think so i want to say that's is that true is that right is that true is that true um oh sigurd um he's from one of the originals uh i don't remember oh he's a uh, it's roy right um who's roy in? is he in the original i don't remember now i'm sorry i wish i could actually say what games they were from that would have been nice. Uh, oh, that's a, a Lynn, right? Yeah. Yeah, Lynn. Lynn is from... Is she from the original? And when I say original, I'm talking about the one we got. Just called Fire Emblem. Uh, which is like the 88th game in the series or something. Um, is, she in the, is she in Sacred Stones? Or is she in Shadow Dragon? Shit. I don't know why I'm looking up. I don't have them. My GBA games are up here, but I don't have... They, only my box games are here, so... And also, even if... I did have a 
box doors with fire on them, it would just say the logo and wouldn't help me <laughs> because it's just the spines. You can't see it. Don't worry. Uh, I don't know these two. I probably do. I just don't know. Here's Ike. Yes. Ike is from chat. No, uh, Path of Radiance. <laughs> too many Fire Emblem games. Um, what's your name? Micaiah. Okay. Micaiah. I don't know. Oh, here's Lucina, of course, from uh, Awakening. I didn't think about it. Here's Corrin, of course, from Fates. And then here is. Oh, oh Milo. Oh, wait. Hold on. They don't even have a new, the new character? Wait, did I just... Am I losing my mind? So it's from... <laughs> they didn't give you a card for the new character. Okay, well, fuck them, I guess. Uh, <laughs> whatever their name is. I don't even... I don't, be, be fair, I don't even know their fucking name. So I guess, hey, that's fair. But anyway, th those are actually nice. I like those. You know it would have been actually really cool if they put the the new character on the front of this little box right here that would see now that would have been shit but uh i get it it's just a celebration of fire emblem so i don't know why they didn't call it like fire emblem like celebration or something engage engage what are you uh are you uh not kirk picard he says that right i don't, I don't watch star trek i look like the kind of guy that would watch star trek but i am t literally wearing a star wars shirt right now so and I do not like Star Wars anymore. I only like this shirt because it's, it's got Chewbacca on it. I love Chewbacca. Anyway, so here's the uh, game. One more time. There you go. There is the spine. And there you go. You got a nice box art, which I assumed you would. And uh, there's the game. And, of course, to end this video just right. All right, I guess let me show it first. Here you go. There you go. And then... Yep, six years later, it still tastes like fucking licking a penny. But, uh, all right, there you go. Uh, and now let's open these tarot cards, because I'm actually interested in seeing what the hell. What the hell? Don't want to cut too much, because I'm like, like, I, I don't know much about tarot cards. Um, but they call, call this a tarot, tarot card deck. So, I, yeah, it's very small, so I'm assuming... Tarot cards come in a very small amount of cards considered that, are, that make it considered a deck. I don't know. I assume this is correct. I have no idea. There you go. That's much better. Um, what did I just unbox recently that had tarot cards? Oh, it was the uh, Persona One More Edition, I think. There you go. That's better. All right. So let's open this. I do like the... Hey, GameStop shoutouts. GameStop... Uh, um, Pure incentives. I rather get something like this than a DLC for a new hat or something. You know what I mean? A new hat. They usually have pins, especially the Nintendo stuff. It's usually like a pin or a... I'm trying to open this one up. I got the long nails too. And... There you go. Well, it kind of bent it. That's fine. Oh no, there's actually a lot more cards in here than I thought. For some reason, I thought there would be like like five in here because it's so small. But that's a good like. Say like here. How many would you say that is? 15 maybe? I don't know. Can I take them out? Good lord. Why is everything so hard? Why is everything so hard? I don't... This is... I really don't want to like rip the shit out of this. Come on. Just come out. Come on. Come on. Come on. Don't be shy. Come on. Don't be shy. There you go. There you go. Yeah, get out of there. Yeah, that's right, punk. See? Just got to pretend to be nice, and then when they come out, you roast them. All right. So, uh, okay. That's a little thing right there. Fire Emblem Tarot Card Deck. Welcome to the world of Elios on the uh, Fire Emblem. This 12-card says... Just like the one the fortune teller uses. All right, well, spoilers. Fucking hell. Here, you want to read that? Go ahead. It's like a little, little pamphlet. Oh, look. It even shows you all the cards. There you go. Massive spoilers. So that's cool. Oh, these are actually sick. What the hell? Okay. Here's the back of them. Nice little... Look at these. I mean, I guess they look like tarot cards, I guess, right? So here you go. Here's one, two, 
do. Here's another do. Do. That's kind of sick. Here's another do. Do. Here's more. Here's more. You want to know what do? Do. There you go. I'm trying not to even really look. Is that Roy? I think that is. I'm not 100% sure. Uh, that's Lynn. There you go. Do. Do. Who's this? That's a uh, lady. <laughs> do. Here's Granny. What is this? Is that Marv? Uh, they're kind of in their own style. Oh, are we going in order? Yeah, okay. Kind of. Do. 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 And then, oh no, one more. Do. Do. And then, do. Do. So there you go. All right, cool, cool, cool. That's actually not a bad little pre order incentive. I like those cards. Will you ever use them for anything? No. I mean, most times, uh, you don't use these, like, fun little card decks. I mean, I don't even know what a tarot card really is. I'm still, I'm still not too sure. So, that's cool. It's supposed to be, isn't there the cards like the little lady flips up and goes and tells you your destiny? I think it even says that in that little pamphlet thing, but I didn't want to read it. So, uh, anyway, all right. There you go, that's it. So I got, got the art cards, got the steel book, you got the art book, and then you got the nice packaging and the poster. Not, not bad for extra 40 bucks, I guess. Like the art book itself, if they sold that separately, they'd probably sell for like 20, 25 bucks maybe. Uh, and everything else, you know. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Anyway, there you go. That's it. Hope you enjoyed. Thank you. Until next time, I'll see you guys later. Goodbye. Oh, I missed the fucking end the goddamn video.